Welcome to Franchuk, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Uh, my name's Troy Goldie, marriage officer, and once again it's my pleasure to be back in the beautiful town of Franchuk, yeah, in the Western Cape in South Africa. And today I am on my way to a wonderful place called Hot Cabria. It is a very old wine farm and it is uh, got quite an interesting history and I will share a little bit of that with you in a moment. But as you can see we are coming into the town of Franschhoek. I know on a previous vlog I did give you some information so I would want to share just a little bit of information if you haven't seen that particular vlog. Uh, Franschhoek is uh, the Eng Afrikaans name for the words uh, French corner. Uh, originally this particular part of the Western Cape was known as Olifantshoek, uh, uh, which is basically elephant's corner and apparently there used to be a lot of wild elephant walking around here. Hard to believe but that is the way the history books tell it. And uh, in 1688 the French Huguenots arrived, I think it's 1650, uh, 1688, I will check. And the venue that we're going to today was one of those wine farms and one of those French Huguenots that arrived. So in 1694 a chap called Pierre Jordan um, started a wine farm on the slopes above Franschhoek and uh, he wanted to mimic the type of wines that came from the area where he was living and that is an area called Cabriere in France and hence the name Hot Cabriere. Uh, he had the, he owned the property obviously for many years and I'm sure that many other people also had the property um, but at some point another family took over and that was in the 1980s um, but it was a chap called Arnhim von Arnhim Yo, this is all based on my memory of my research that I did prior to uh, leaving for this wedding but what was interesting was that um, they acquired a piece of the original estate or original farm or whatever it was and they started why are you going so slow my friend um, they started this particular place Hart Cabria um, and it was exactly 300 years it was exactly 300 years I don't know what you're doing. Uh, it was exactly 300 years to the day. It was the 22nd of December 1694 that Pierre Jordan actually was granted that piece of land and it was the 22nd of December 1994 that Hout Cabrier, the restaurant and wine cellar, was opened and that was done by the Von Arnhem, Arnhem family. Directly in front of me we have the Huguenot monument. This is a monument to all the French Huguenots. Uh, it is the center of the town as far as um, landmarks are concerned and uh, it is absolutely beautiful. There's a lovely museum that you can come and you can have a look at all the old French stuff and uh, everything that leads or has anything to do with this wonderful town. Right, so now we're making our way up towards the Franschhoek Pass and uh, we're not going to go all the way up, unfortunately for today. Um, all my buddies on bikes, hello guys. Um, I love the fact that bikers always greet each other. It's like some unwritten code that you would say hello to every biker that you see. I love that. Um, and my nature is to say hello to anybody anyway although I don't say hello to every person in a car but that's beside the point alright so who am I going to marry here today I'm going to marry a wonderful couple called Michael and Carla and I am super excited about it because they are an awesome couple they live in the wonderful country of Australia down under uh, although they're both South African citizens um, uh, they are here. Now Hot Cabrera is right here and uh, it's actually built into the slopes of the mountain and it literally is a 
piece of land that was purchased um, I think it was a quarry or something at one stage and it had been blasted and mined or they got this particular um, area available um, for quite a good price because it wasn't really developed it was blasted it was holes it was and what they did is they created this wonderful wine farm or cellar I should say restaurant cellar and uh, we are going to be marrying this wonderful couple today underground uh, actually down in the cellar and I'll show you some of that footage and I'll show you what it looks like but as you can see guys it's an awesome and wonderful day it's the 15th of uh, April 2017 and once again thank you for being with me I will talk to you inside Welcome to Hot Cabria. Well, welcome to Hot Cabria. And this is where the wedding is going to take place, down there in the cellar. I'm standing up in the restaurant area, looking down at the venue for the actual wedding. And it looks beautiful with the draping of the lights and the candles along the floor. I'll show you what it looks like down there. But it is spectacular if you consider this is all underground which is quite amazing and then the building itself inside this is the restaurant area and this is where the reception is going to be held it looks absolutely magnificent I love the color schemes Hi there, I'm Sam, I'm with Crimson Edge Events, I'm the Principal Planner and Lead um, Coordinator um, and I'm here today to, uh, to plan for Carla and Michael's wedding. Um, Hello, we I'm are Five Seasons Classical Ensembles, I'm Ariella and I'm Vincent and yeah, we're going to be providing some nice warm welcoming background entertainment for the ceremony that takes place. Yeah. Be seated. <laughs> Looks like Michael's been peeling some onions. <laughs> That's your story, and you're sticking to it. <laughs> right, so you guys are on the verge of being legally married. But what you've chosen to do is to do the signing of the register over there. So I'm going to ask you, Michael, to open the gates. We'll just be a few moments. The two witnesses, if you could come forward as well, please. Yeah. I'm going to ask you to sign where it's your signature of wife in your maiden name for the last time, please. I therefore now have the privilege to declare that you, Michael and Carla, are now lawfully married and are to be husband and wife together from this day forward. That which has been joined together, let no one ever divide. Michael, warm them up. <laughs> I'd like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Slochter. Make some noise.
thanks ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me. My name is Troy Goldie, marriage officer. I want to just congratulate once again Michael and Carla. Thank you very much for having me as part of your wedding and having me as part of your wonderful and special day. I hope you've enjoyed the vlog. Thank you for joining me once again. You can find me on my Facebook page, Troy Goldie Marriage Officer. You will also find a YouTube channel under Troy Goldie Marriage Officer. If you want to get in contact with me, you're more than welcome to send me an email at weddings at telcomsa.net. It doesn't matter where you are in the world. And if you would like to send me an email, you can do that at weddings at telcomsa.net. Or you can phone me with the plus 27 prefix for South Africa, 021930519. And also my mobile, which is 082-852-4571. And then if you would like to, you're more than welcome just to like, subscribe or share my vlogs. It will be fantastic to have you with me as I go to different venues all over the Western Cape, here in the beautiful Cape Town in Western Cape, to have you along for the ride. But as you can see, the beautiful sunset. Have an awesome, wonderful day. And thank you guys, everybody. Thank you for joining me. Cheers. Bye-bye.